Assalamu alaikum student today we will discuss about four generation of computer chapter number 1 class 9 computer science of FBISC in this uh, topic we will discuss the technology duration features and advantages and disadvantages of four generation now come to the duration 1971 to till present and the technology Uh, used VLSI that is called very large scale integration means millions of transistor on a single silicon chip you can see the images on your screen that microprocessor chips also uh, is there and you can see the millions of transistors we could not see from the naked eye so that is called VLSI now come to the computers which were developed in fourth generation a microprocessor or computer chip core to do and intel pentium 4 is you can see on your screen in the 10 years back or 15 years back those computers were popular and nowadays we are using core i5 core i3 core i7 and core i9 microprocessors in our desktop computers and laptop computers so these are the chips of uh, core i series now come to the computers in the past we have intel pentium series pc or desktop computer laptop you can see in your screen 10 years or 15 years back we used these computers now come to the current era computers of fourth generation core i5 series and uh, desktop and laptop you can see on your screen there are two computers one is laptop and other one is desktop and both have core i5 vlsi chip now come to the features four generation become more powerful more reliable time sharing and network distribution operating system introduced and languages c c++ database were introduced in four generation and the advantages are they are uh, totally general purpose smaller in size heat generation is negligible no cooling system is required in four generation in most of the co- cases no cooling system is required and disadvantage is very advanced technology is required to fabricate ic high quality reliable system technology can make ic's cooling system in required in some cases the latest technology is required for the manufacturing microprocessors so these were the advantages and uh, disadvantages of four generation of computer hope you will understand if you have any query any question you can ask thank you